fade. What's that over there? Is that a mermaid? <laughs> but far from the sea for a mermaid, mate. That's Greg Turner. Greg who? Greg Turner. He comes from New Zealand sporting world. He's really the whole family. His brother played cricket for New Zealand. His brother played hockey for New Zealand. And uh, Greg, I, Greg, I understand, is not a bad little golfer and a very good course designer. Jeez, they must have had a few balls in their time. <laughs> Let's go and say hi to him, mate. So, Greg, you're a Dunedin boy, but you're up in Queenstown. How'd you end up here? 20 years, almost a local. Um, look, you know, if you live in Dunedin, I mean, you're from Dunedin, um, you spend all your time in Central Otago in the holidays. Yeah, and uh, when I was playing in Europe, I was back here at the summertime. Not much point being in Dunedin. All your mates are in Queenstown and Wanaka and Central Otago. Obviously, being a great player, you've evolved that into design. Yeah, look, they don't go hand in hand, I don't think, um, but it's a head start. You, you play the game at all levels, you get to play with people of various uh, uh, abilities, um, and you get to see a lot of golf courses around the world. So it's a, it was a progression I wanted to make, and, I'm, and I've been really in, been enjoying it. We have a tradition on Golf Getaway. It's a celebrity hole. I've been reading online where you believe the ninth on the arrow here at Millbrook is one of the finest finishing holes in golf. Well, it's a nice spot, put it that way, to finish, and uh, and it's right beside the bar. So I don't know what the tradition is with golf getaway, but I assume close as the pen, uh, you know, loser buys the beer. Is that right? Yeah, loser buys the beer. Although we have got a bottle of um, Central Otago's finest from Peregrine's, a bottle of Pinot. Would you like that? Pinot. I'll tell you what. I'll take I'll take I'll take a bottle of uh, Peregrine Pinot Noir over a beer any time. All right. Let's head to the night. Oh oh. old rugby injuries, <laughs> just a little bit of trouble swinging through the ball. I, 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 just not quite enough club, eh, Fade? Never mind. Well, you boys carry on. I'm, I'm a bit worried that Andrew's got me here, though. But you can see, Andrew, when you get up here, it's just, just a gorgeous place to finish your day. When you've got the Mill House over here, which is, you know, one of the fantastic restaurants, you've got the putting green and all that schist rock, you've got all the old farm buildings, lovely pond. I mean, it's just a neat place to finish a round of golf. Right, I double or nothing. Do we get a chance if I make it two? <laughs> yeah, 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 because I've got to live with them, remember? Go in, go in, oh. go in. Oh. Oh. Close, but no cigar. You can have that one. <laughs> Thanks very much, guys. Thanks, Greg, for being on Golf Getaway. It's terrific to have you. Hey, Thanks, Greg. It's a pleasure. It's a nice place we get to live in, so uh, glad you guys could make it. What a gorgeous golf course. Yeah. What a gorgeous day. And I'm looking forward to that peregrine, boys. Should we go and yeah. have a glass now? <laughs> Sounds good to me. I told you, he started. I'm going to get it all night. <laughs>